you pack the flashlight, the blanket, and the mat? It's a real adventure, the trail you're looking at. I'm glad you came for a while, I thought you might be bailing. Is that the same yellow shirt you used to wear? But a thousand years seem like almost no time now. This guitar right here, do you still remember how? It is so hot outside. Hey everybody, what is up and welcome back to my channel. If you are new here, hello. My name is Katie. I live in the blazing hot state of Florida. It is currently 95 degrees and it's so hot in my car. But hi, if you are new here, I make all shop with me videos, home decor videos. I love to shop at like TJ Maxx, Target, Walmart, Home Goods as well to show you what you could potentially find at a store near you. So if you love videos like that, definitely make sure you give this video a big thumbs up and hit the subscribe button down below if you are not already subscribed to my channel. My last Home Goods video you guys loved. I found the most amazing furniture finds. I don't know what it was, if they just got like the best shipment ever and I just happened to go on the right day, but I found the coolest furniture finds and you guys loved this video. So I'm really excited to be back today at Home Goods so you can see what is new this week. Definitely gonna be shopping the furniture section, but I also wanna look at like rugs as well as like lamps, throw pillows, things I don't show as often. Definitely let me know down below what is your favorite section of the store. Do you love like the bathroom decor, the bedding? Do you love the furniture, the home decor, the kitchen stuff? Definitely let me know what is your section because it will definitely inspire me to check out other sections that I don't shop at as often. I feel like I tend to like go in like the same areas, but I really want to branch out So I want to know what you guys want to see from me So definitely let me know down below, but I'm really excited to get into home goods So let's head inside the store and see what is new this week at home goods This is the first thing I noticed when I walked in. This is literally the biggest umbrella I've ever seen in my entire life like it's huge so it'd be so nice if you had like an epic backyard or it would cover like an eight-person outdoor table super nice these are a return these are nice i like the like legs on the bottom they're a good width i would definitely probably like spray paint the knob or just change the knob but those are actually super super nice another really nice umbrella here a lot of cool outdoor items this is only 99 dollars. i feel like that's huge i always feel like the furniture section at this location is like pretty bare but especially right now like at my like normal home goods that i shop at you can't even walk in here at all because there's so much furniture i really like this coffee table very neutral top like mixes of warm and cool tones which is super super nice and i like the bottom how it's like see-through it helped create like a really light and airy feel in your living room it's a great size i love this these are so pretty definitely true um like counter height stools they're really tall 150 dollars a piece and i love this like leaf pattern so so pretty like i was saying in my last home goods shop with me stuff like this like you could always decide to sell it on facebook marketplace and recoup the costs if you ever want to like change them out and get new bar stools or something but these are gorgeous this is so cool i don't exactly know like what you could use it for because it's really low maybe like a rolling um like side table or little like coffee table for like outdoors or something not exactly sure but it is on wheels it's super super pretty i love like the bamboo and the rattan and this is 80 dollars. this half circle table is really nice it has a tray on the bottom and the top could be really fun to decorate but i really like the shape of it it would look really good with a round mirror and that is 150. they have a bunch of air fryers like just not even in boxes or anything these look like the size of my air fryer seven quarts which i always recommend to get like a really big air fryer so that you can like cook enough food for two people but they have a bunch of them here i'm obsessed with my air fryer can't recommend air fryer enough so if you don't have one, this might be a good opportunity to look at home goods to pick one up. This is super cute. I really like this little countertop system. I wonder if it like comes with all of this stuff. It does say it includes the rail system. Oh yeah, two bins, three hooks, and one tray. So it does come with like all this little stuff. That is super, super nice. Really would go with like my little kind of like modern bohemian, almost Scandinavian theme I have going in our apartment. I really, really like this. I wish it came with like these little bottles and stuff because that definitely like adds to it or these little things it just comes with like this these and then the bins but i love the way they have it styled this is on clearance for 15 dollars i actually really really like it so that's kind of everything you get but i would aim to style it just like that and i have enough wooden spoons to like 
I don't even know, Supply Italy. Shut the hell up right now. This is a pineapple neon sign. It's like already kind of open. Oh my God. Pineapple neon light. Um, do we need it or do we need it? Oh, these are awesome. These little like round trays with like the black handles. They come in a couple different sizes, but I really, really like those. This is a cute little cookie jar. It's like Ray Dunn 4th of July item. I think it's a cookie jar. Adorable. Why is there a hearth and hand item here at Home Goods? This is literally Hearth and Hand from Magnolia. This is from the new summer collection. I'm really surprised to see this here. Well, I guess if you were wanting this, you could definitely look at your home goods because at Target it's $36.99 and they have it here at Home Goods for $20. So that's pretty crazy. I have not seen like in season Target items or Target items at all at Home Goods before. So that is really interesting. They have these little red Ray Dunn birdhouses. Those are cute. They're like actually a really similar color to my nails, like a reddish orange color. That's a really pretty color. This basket is the most beautiful basket like in the whole world. I love it. This would look so good under my console table, like my entryway table. This would look super, super pretty. I do wish that it was black. I feel like the black would look better because we have like black accents in that area. But this is stunning. This is only $24.99 and it's the Tropical Elements brand. I've been obsessed with everything they've been putting out. They also have this really cute little like stool or like rattan plant stand that is stunning. Also the bar stools that I showed you before, the like green leaf ones were also this brand. So definitely check your store for this brand if you like love Bohemian natural stuff because you will love it look at all of these pretty wall baskets oh my gosh is that not so pretty and then like that one too these are a great size if you're wanting to do like a basket wall you can definitely find some awesome awesome pieces to add to that I have been putting together a basket wall for months and months it's nearly ready um, you're definitely going to be seeing it in an upcoming transformation video. It will be the last in the trilogy and then we can do our full apartment tour once everything is like good and decorated. But we have one major area left and I'm so ready to start doing that video. But I just had to take a break after my entry transformation video. I will have it linked down below if you haven't seen it yet. It came out amazing, but it was definitely like really, really like mentally challenging to do that video because things just weren't going the way I needed to. So I had to like take a break and I talk about everything and like the reality of like trying to decorate a space and how tough it can be, especially when you're on a budget. So I will link that down below for you if you haven't seen it yet. All of that to say though, I have been collecting baskets for a really long time for it because I don't know, like I just wanted to like really take my time and then it ended up like it was going to go in a different area and then I decided to save it for our master bedroom which is gonna be the last video in the trilogy I'm so excited to get it done because our bedroom is like not decorated at all not like we spend the most time in there but it will be really nice once it's done so make sure you are subscribed so you don't miss that video probably next month checking out the clearance section and I just found decapitated Minnie Mouse <laughs> oh no they have a lot of really nice bath items like soap dispensers a lot of different like styles too so definitely make sure you're checking the clearance section they have these like toilet paper holders on clearance and even if you don't like the color like you could easily spray paint it and this is a really good way to save money definitely make sure you look for these in all the aisles too because this is all clearance super nice like neutral bath mats and these are all on clearance like I think just to make room for like new inventory there's nothing wrong with them so definitely make sure you are looking for these little signs in the aisles as well another example are these like little duvets and mattress covers just on clearance hidden in this aisle and end cap clearance too so just make sure you are checking all over the stores and look for these little clearance signs here at the front of the store they do have like a father's day gifting station set up so it's just gonna have like good items collected from around the stores, but it's just like here for you to make it super easy to shop. So if you're looking for a Father's Day gift for a father figure in your life, maybe your husband, if he's a father to human children or fur children, they do have some really good gift options here. So they do have some really cool like stein 
lines and stuff. Brian is super interested in like his Irish heritage, so he would really like something like this. They have like a Colada one and a couple different options for that. Then they do have like a German Stein that's like a bit more intricate. These are cool. They do come with like a certificate inside to like tell you more about it and where it was made. They have like this really nice Italian leather like cosmetic bag, which is super, super nice. So they have a couple different varieties of that. They have a lot of like fitness related items that they put together, like a pull up bar for like over a door. They also have little like folding fitness mats, little like bounce ball chairs. So, you know, maybe to help with like balance if they work from home, this could be a really good gift. They have like little items here that you could use to maybe redo like their man cave, just to like redecorate and stuff. They have like fishing related items, sports related items. So just like a bunch of stuff like that over here. I think it's really cool that these stores have set up these areas to make it really easy for you to shop for Father's Day. Just try not to get sucked into shopping for yourself and home decor while you're there because that's what happens to me. Interesting find stuck over here are these like tanning mousses. I've actually heard this brand is really good, Bee Tan, and there's also um, Mine Tan. So these are only $4.99. I know that fake tan stuff like this is normally way more expensive. So I wanted to show you that you can potentially find these at your TJ Maxx, Home Goods, and Marshalls stores. Personally, I don't use fake tanner, um, but if you do, this could be a really good way to save money on it. Okay, I just got home and the only item I picked up at Home Goods was I'm so excited to set this up. Brian was like, don't come home without that. Like he wanted it really bad. So I'm really excited to get it all set up. Bum bada bum 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 bada bum 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 bada bum 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 Okay. Has really good packaging. I'm so, so excited. So there's like a bunch of different pieces. There's also a lot of like protective gear. This box is so fun. Let me go ahead and get it all set up and I'll be right back. Okay, here it is. It was super easy to set up. I just basically had to plug stuff in. Ready? Oh my God, this is the cutest thing ever. Oh my God, $50 well spent, people. I'm in love. Like literally, what are the odds of like finding something like this at Home Goods? This is like such a niche product. This was totally made for us. All right, you guys. Well, that is going to be it for me today. I really hope that you enjoyed seeing everything that is new this week at Home Goods. Definitely let me know down below what was your favorite thing I showed in today's video. If you haven't yet, please make sure you give this video a big thumbs up. Hit the subscribe button down below, and I will see you next time. Bye, guys.